and then you just rev up and it stops it right there for you what's up guys uh welcome back to the channel uh if you're new here go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button um today we're going to be trying out the launch control in the car um i haven't tried it out yet i want to see how good it is uh, and i'm going to show you how to set that up and then we're going to give it a shot all right so let's go ahead and throw this on there's two different ways you can do this so you can either go into the my mode menu um, you can go down to your track apps and you can go in and you can go on in here to, let's see here, maybe it's not in there, launch control, it's not in there, so you, it's just its own setting. You can turn that on, and it throws up the little LC down at the bottom, um, go ahead and turn that off. Another way you can do this is you can go over here to your modes, and you can go up to drag strip mode, and it'll throw it on. Um, but anyways, let's go back into the launch control menu. You can set your RPMs. We're just going to do, you know, a 3000, let's do a 3500 RPM uh, launch. Um, you just set whatever RPMs. You'll have to figure that out for your car, depending on what tires you have, how old they are, how new they are. Um, we'll see if mine spin or break loose or not. Um, but anyways, your car has to be at idling temperature for this to come on or uh, not idling, operating temperature for this to come on. If not, this it will not allow you to turn launch control on. But anyways, I have a manual. I don't know how it works in the automatic, but we'll throw this on. Um, you push the clutch down all the way, and then you just rev up, and it stops it right there for you. Um, one thing that I, I'm not sure of is if it holds a brake for you, so you might want to try this on level ground or maybe try it on a hill and let me know if it holds a brake for you or not. Because um, all I know is that I have to hold down the clutch and hold down the gas and then pop the clutch and it takes off um, but I tried it one time and it started rolling on me so um, anyways bear with me I'm doing this one-handed I don't have the GoPro today uh, so probably just gonna do a first gear launch um, but let's give it a shot Um, so as you could hear, I broke loose. Uh, I do not have, I did not have traction control off. Um, I don't know if that would have helped. Traction control might've kicked in and, uh, powered me down a little bit. Um, but it worked. Uh, I might, you know, when I get new tires, I might try it at a higher RPM and see if we can get going faster. Um, but anyways, that's, that's how you do launch control. Um, so give it a shot. Let me know about the brake thing if uh, it holds a brake for you. I'm on a hill, I guess we can give it a shot now. So let's just push the clutch in. See, I'm not rolling at the moment. Well, no, I am rolling backwards. So it does, it does roll. So if you know how to get the car to stay still when you're doing a launch on a slight hill, let me know. But anyways, Anyways, that is it for this video. Um, so like and subscribe. Next, we'll try out the line lock, but I'm going to wait on that one until it's about time for some new tires because I don't want to ruin my tires before they're due to be changed. But yep, like and subscribe. See you guys next time.